those celebrations in the county of Nyeri. Now, four police officers from the Rapid Border Patrol unit and a civilian were killed today after the vehicle they were traveling in ran over an improvised explosive device suspected to have been planted by Al-Shabaab militants. Baware area, which is on the northern part of Lamu, has experienced several militant attacks since 2014. Francis and Tom on our reports. There is renewed tension in Baure area of Lamu constituency. This is after an attack of an armored police carrier transporting some seven police officers of the Rapid Border Patrol Unit and a civilian. The carrier had just left Mangai for Mokowe for refueling. On reaching Baure, the vehicle ran over an improvised explosive device suspected to have been planted by Al Shabaab militants. The exact location being between Milimani and Baure military camp in Basuba Ward. Four officers and a civilian died on the spot. Two other police officers are reported missing. Police sources say KDF officers from the Baure military camp responded immediately, but they were also attacked on the way to the scene by the militants. The KDF officers, however, managed to reach the scene of the incident, only to find the worst had happened. Since 2014, Baure area has experienced a series of militant attacks, largely blamed on the Jaish Aman group a deadly cell of the Al-Shabaab terror organization. Around the same area in 2015, just on the anniversary of the Mpeketoni attack, six KDF soldiers were also killed, while 18 militants perished in the same onslaught. British jihadist Thomas Evans lost his life during the exchange. The Kenyan government launched a multi-agency security operation dubbed Linda Boni on September 15, 2015, whose major target was to flush out Al-Shabaab militants believed to be hiding inside the expansive Boni forest. And although the area seemed to have experienced a lull in the attacks, Kenyan authorities continue to train their focus around the forested area, believed to be a key operational base for recruiting and planning terror attacks at the coast of Kenya.